I'm Keely and this is Voice of a Creative and today I'm here to do another Sew My Stash video. So I really enjoyed the last Sew My Stash video where I gave four options and then did a poll to choose which one I was going to make and that ended up being the Kilo Wrap Dress and then I managed to do a Sew Along video which I will link below and that was based on the um, item that you all chose. Now it's going to be slightly different today, I've chosen all kind of sweater patterns, it's got so cold uh, over here in England and it's just, well, it's really cold and you want to wear snuggly warm jumpers. So I've got a few uh, sweater patterns and a few different fabrics and I want you to choose kind of which I should make first. Now it is which will, what will I make first because I'm probably going to make them all eventually um, but I will hopefully be able to do another sew along with whichever pattern you choose and I've chosen a sweater just because they're quite a quick make so it means that I should be able to kind of get it done after school or at a weekend um, when I don't have as long amount of time because those sew along videos do take a little bit longer. Now I have tried a slightly different setup with lights today so, so hopefully the video is a lot more lit. Let me know your thoughts on that um, because I'm just experimenting at the moment to see what works out best for the video and so I can film at night. I mean it is daylight outside but it's raining and the sky is really grey so it's not necessarily good light so I've got the lights on to help. So I just wanted to show you this necklace. So I just got this from So Dainty and it's clear acrylic with kind of a silver background and a little diamante but it arrived today and it's just really cute and I'm also wearing my Hello Heine Hello Sugar um, Sour Pink and Blue Bottle pin as well and my nice and cosy uh, Elliot sweater hack where I've extended the sleeves and added cuffs like the Blackwood cardigan. So let me show you the choices. So I don't have all the patterns here, but what I will do is if I mention a pattern, I will pop a picture of it so that you can see what it looks like. So the first choice is this one. So this is a pattern I was gifted recently from Lorian, and I would make this uh, version here. So I would try and add the frills, I think. Um, but I would, might add a bit slimmer cuffs and it would just be this, it's a drop shoulder jumper basically. And because I've never made this before, um, I've chosen a fabric that will go with it, but it's a slightly cheaper sweatshirting. So it's this one, so it's this really beautiful cranberry colour. And it's really lovely and fleecy on the inside. And I just think that would be really nice and bright and cheery. And I think it's the right tone for me. Um, and I think that would be really cute as that jumper. So that's choice number one. The cranberry sweatshirting with the simplicity 8752. Choice number two is one of two patterns. But they're kind of uh, the same. But they just have different sleeve options. So it is the I am patterns, I am zebra or I am lion pattern. So one has, and I don't know, I can't remember which way round it is. I will put it down below. One has a puff shoulder and then normal sleeves. And one has the kind of drapey sleeves. So um, I've seen both and they both look really cool. So either one with a puff sleeve or one with a more drapey sleeve. And the fabric I've got is this. Now I got this from Like So Amazing and I think this was either the beginning of this year or last year, but it's this really fine knit sweatshirting. And I thought that this would work really well for this pattern. Uh, I might use ribbing for the neckband, but I think it would work really well for this because it's really nice and drapey. And I thought actually with a skirt, I could probably get away with wearing it to school because it is really quite a fine knit fabric. But yeah, really love that. And I do think that uh, Sarah's got some similar ones to this still in stock if you wanted to have a look. So I will link those down below. But really beautiful um, knit fabric in the either the I Am Zebra or I Am Lion uh, sweatshirt pattern. The next is a jumper very similar to the one that I'm wearing. So the, the Elliot sweater I've made quite a few times and I've hacked it to have the long sleeves and cuffs. And I just find it so super cozy. 
and I've also done a rounded hem. I will post a picture so you can see. But I want to make a few more. So I would say this is probably the most boring choice, but probably well, maybe the one I'd wear the most, I'm not sure. So I got this uh, fabric last winter from Sew Me Sunshine. And it's this beautiful sweatshirting with a very fine dot to it. Really love this. I have the light blue version, which in a sweatshirt that I wear all the time as well. But I really love the little dot, really comfy, cozy fabric, really high quality. And I would literally make an Elliot sweater in it. And uh, and it would base and that's by Helen's Closet and it basically be the same as this so cuffs long sleeves rounded hem or maybe um a cropped hem I'm not too sure I basically judge it when I make it uh and that would be in this one so that is the third choice an Elliot sweater in this beautiful fabric here and the last one would be a Freya sweater now I've made this quite a few times before I would make my hacked version with the slightly lower neckline um, but otherwise no other changes and it's using this beautiful fabric here so this is a French terry but I've made the fryer in a French terry before and it looked really lovely and it's just got the green base with the flowers on top a lot of these fabrics are from last winter and I didn't make them at the time so now it's kind of choosing which I should make first but really beautiful pattern really cute um, design with the flowers and the little bit of pink as well and that would be a Freya sweater. So that's all of the choices. So the four choices are the simplicity hacking pattern in the cranberry sweatshirting, the I am zebra or I am lion sweatshirt pattern from I am patterns in the navy blue and white fine knit fabric, the Elliot sweater in the navy with the coloured dot or the Freya sweater in the green French terry with flowers on it. If you think any of the fabrics would fit another pattern, please go ahead and comment that below as well, um, because I really appreciated your help in choosing the last time, and I'm hoping that this will help me choose and then I can just go ahead and make it. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked this video, please press the thumbs up and subscribe if you want to hear more from me. Goodbye.